Okay, welcome to today's video. Uh, we're going to be taking a look at uh, how we can use Google Images for our background picture um, or either as our wallpaper on the computer monitor here. Um, first thing we want to do is find out what resolution uh, do we have as a uh, monitor. So we simply right click with the mouse and uh, I'm using a German version of Windows so mine uh, down here will look a little bit different but yours you can, uh, it should say properties uh, or your settings down here. So the last one and bring up a pop-up window and just choose the last tab. And once you've got the last tab you'll be able to see the resolution of your monitor down here. Uh, I'm using a two monitor setup, so I have two of the little squares in here, but if you're using only one monitor, you should only have one. Uh, just note that or either remember uh, the resolution, so you'll be needing that a little bit later. So once we've got that information, uh, then we can go down and we can open up Google search and we simply type in what we're looking for uh, for images or pictures and uh, to save a little time I've already did Stonehenge in here for example once you did your search go over to images and you'll see that we get lots of images of Stonehenge uh, now a lot of times these images are not the size we're looking for as you can see this one is 700 times 257 uh, some of them will maybe be smaller 320 times 257 uh, we don't want that we want the exact size of our resolution and uh, the way you can get that uh, simply go here to search tools uh, sometimes you'll find that over here on the left hand side as well but once you go to search tools uh, you can then go any size exactly and then type in exactly the size you're looking for in our case the 1440 times 900 uh, hit enter and you'll see it pulls up only images which are 1440 times 900 um, you just choose which one uh, that you like here uh, you find one going down through here so once you find the image uh, which you really like uh, then you can uh, go ahead and uh, just simply click on that image uh, and whenever you click on the image then it may bring up a preview uh, on a website for example uh, that uh, is not the full size resolution that we need uh, you'll see over here on the right hand side it will say full size image simply click on that and it will take you to the image uh, directly and from here we can then simply right mouse click and save image as uh, and save that to your computer now once you get it saved uh, to your computer you need to remember where you saved it uh, to and once you've got that completed you just simply go back to your desktop uh, right mouse click again that very bottom properties and then the second tab here uh, once you go to the second tab then we're going to have to find that picture that we just uh, had and we'll go here Stonehenge click that and you'll see it's already put in here for us and we'll just complete that okay and now we've got a new background image uh, for our uh, windows I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, look forward to, to seeing you again bye bye